Union School District has resigned. This after he was arrested in Florida for allegedly soliciting prostitution. Our Jason Sloss has new information on the undercover operation and the district's response. And where would we be with a human trafficking operation without an elected official. The Polk County Sheriff's Office in Florida announcing Thursday it arrested 213 people during a seven day undercover human trafficking sting. During a news conference, Sheriff Grady Judd held up mugshots of several suspects, including Scott Wooden, a member of the Del Mar Union School District Board of Trustees since 2010. Now, don't you want this guy making decisions for your children? According to the Sheriff's Office, part of the operation targeted people soliciting prostitution online. Investigators say an undercover deputy posted an escort ad and was later contacted by Wooden through phone calls and text messages. Then Wooden agreed to meet at a location to pay for sex last Saturday when he was arrested. He was supposedly here helping his mom and dad and hey he had a little few minutes so he decided he would come here and engage in sex. He solicited sex for $200. According to the sheriff's report, in an interview after his arrest, Wooden said he, quote, got caught doing something stupid. This guy knows better. He's supposed to be a leader in the community. He's an elected official. He's making decisions for our children, and he's out soliciting prostitutes. According to a now erased bio on the district's website, Wooden is a retired molecular biologist with a PhD, married with two children, and was in his fourth term on the school board. The Del Mar Union School District released a statement saying the district received notification that Scott Wooden has resigned from the district's governing board of trustees effective immediately. The board is currently exploring options to fill the vacancy. We will keep the community informed as the district moves through this process. The school district says it learned about the arrest Thursday morning. As for Wooden, he posted bail and was released Monday. In Carmel Valley, Jason Sloss, Fox 5 News.